What's up, y'all? This is Mina Means once again. Time Oracle here. Today is April 9th, 2022. Current time reads it is 331. 331. Mm -hmm. I do hope everyone is well. Right. <sighs> All right. Hold on. Let me put on his glove. Because no glove, no love. No glove, no love. Let me put on his glove. Because no glove, no love. Let me find out that resonates with somebody. No glove, no love. Let me find out somebody trying to... um. Let me find out. Yup. You put this glove on. No glove, no love. All right, are we good? Why does it seem like, hold on, what? Okay, all right, yeah, I'm good. I'm golden. Okay, so we are gonna set it off. I'm freestyling with these messages because it is what it is. I, you know, I get bored with like systematic shit. So things gotta switch up with me, right? Things got to switch up. Father. Okay, so we have the masculine deck. Okay. I don't know. The masculine deck is like this. Somebody meditating. You see that right there? What's the fit? Didn't I just bring out what? I ain't bring out the feminine deck. Oh, Sierra, I get up. Hold on. What? could be, you know, seeking for peace, trying to reconcile. It could be in a meditative state about you. Maybe not, but let me just find out. Um, masculine is, 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 you know, is in this uh, inner peace, hermit mode type of vibe, right? You could be nowhere to be found. Maybe, maybe the masculine can't find you. Okay. But we, we, um, yeah. Let's see what Divine Feminine is talking about. What's the Divine Feminine energy? Oh, boy. Mm -hmm. Okay, so Divine Feminine. Oh, you the High Priestess. Oh, that's what's up. You the High Priestess. Divine This is your energy, and it says here... I am one with my soul, and my soul is a legacy of love. Okay. So we have the masculine and the feminine. The masculine, the ma oh, Lord, I can't even talk. The masculine could be seeking you. He could be praying for a woman like you. Maybe you two are in separation, and maybe he's just praying. I don't know. Maybe he just wants to reconcile. But this is what I'm getting. Okay. He's gonna put these down like this. Okay, this is going on right here. Mm -hmm. Boy, oh boy. Okay, so let's go around the clock. Father God, speak to me. What's going on? What's going on? Divine masculine energies. Because remember, these are just the energy, the energies at the bottom of the deck. Father God, what is the actual? What's the Oh, damn. So we got a lot. Okay. Divine Masculine was left hanging. Somebody got ghosted? We have the adventurer with the deadbeat, with the money, with the judge, and a call to change. Somebody, somebody, I don't know, Divine Feminine, did you, did you ghost Divine Masculine? Did you leave this Masculine hanging? Because that's what we have. The adventurer, deadbeat, with the money, with the judge, and the call to change. Oh, boy. Mm -hmm. 
Look at that. This is all masculine energy. Um, I'm also picking up some masculine work too much. Yeah, masculine work too much. I feel like masculine wants to let you know that he's just very busy. I don't know, some of you feel like you've been ghosted. Some of you feel ignored. Some of you feel like, what the fuck? But don't feel that way because the deadbeat, it's like somebody is saying, let's hang out, let's like spend time with me or some shit. But it's like, I can't just let go of the money. I can't just be a deadbeat to the money to hang out with you. I gotta make a decision here. So I feel like um, masculine could be trying to like change jobs. That's not for everybody. I'm also picking up for some of you, um, Divine Masculine received a phone call to change plans. Something like that. All right, we have that. Now let's see what's up with feminine because she the high priestess. This is what your energy is right now. But let's really see what's going on. Father God, what's going on with um wasn't we supposed to go around the clock with the with, with the masculine though? What wasn't we supposed to go around the clock? Father God, speak to me. What is the actual feminine energy? We have oh damn. That wasn't even supposed to fall. Segments, segments. You know what? I love. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Segments. This wasn't supposed to fall. These two flip over. This just kind of out of the deck out of nowhere. But before we do that, there's something I gotta show you. Hold on, because segment appeared to my ass the other day. Segment. Segment. You know how I be doing, right? Hold on, cause you know, like. Spirits, the spirits, deities, honor the deities around you. Segment appeared to me. You know how every time I be like doing stuff around the house and it's either a shadow or image, something segment appeared to me. I think it was two days ago and I need to show you because I was like, yo. And first of all, I didn't even know who it was. All I know is that she was an Egyptian goddess that appeared to me. And the first thing that came to my mind was segment. Okay, and I don't even fully know. I don't even fully know what her powers are and all of that. I just know of her name. Hold on. She appeared to my ass. Where that picture is at? Where that picture? Oh, here it go. Okay. So this is this is okay. This is um my sink and for some reason i always get messages when i'm when i'm near water but this is my my sink right the faucet but i'm gonna zoom in on it so you can see how she appeared to me all right now if you look closely right here i i don't know i saw i was i was brushing my teeth and i saw this right here and i said oh my god segment do you see how it's like a, a moon right there and then like the, the goddess body going down like this? Segment appeared to my ass, honey, and it was, when was that? What? Yo. That was two days ago. Anyway. So I, I'm, I'm, I'm blown away right now because Segment, the red lady, comes out of the deck and she wasn't supposed to, but she did anyway. So this says here, she says, I am pure strength. I honor my anger by giving voice to it. Woo! Segment, baby. Yes. We'll get into the two I flipped over my hand. Segment says, I'm going to say it again. She the red lady. I am pure strength. You see how she got her arms folded? She ain't playing with you. And then it say, I honor my anger by giving voice to it. <laughs> so 
Somebody needs to express yourself. Somebody need, you I don't know. I don't know who you are, but somebody, um, yeah. All right. So then these are the two energies that flipped over my hand. It says, <sighs> miraculous healing. It says, I am ready to heal. I am worthy of the miracles meant for me. And also Lala, the saint of spoken words. Every word I say becomes a prayer. I am the author of my own story. So healing and prayers, healing and prayers. But at the same time, when you got to put somebody in a place, you might just, you, you might want to go ahead and do that. Okay. With segment right here. Um, whew, boy, oh boy, this is a lot. This how we setting off. That's this how we gonna set her off today. Ooh, all right. I'm gonna try to go around this clock, but this is it's just a lot going on in this table already, just between masculine and feminine alone. So we gonna I'm gonna try to just like cram all of this up into the middle. All right, Father God, let's go ahead and do this. So we have diplomat, integration, the wizard, entitled prince. We have tests and trials, crossing the threshold. We have the activist, the comedian, the strategist, the inventor, the final approach, and constant rescuer with the damn charlatan at the bottom. It's why masculine is in prayer or he's in meditation right now because he knows that this is his call to change because his ass been like this with his phony ass. Mm -hmm. Let me find out somebody about to get cussed out. Let me find out. So I kind of want to say this is what somebody get for coming in like this. Strategist coming in with a plan, right? But the plan is not for anything good. The plan is more like con artist is what I'm getting. Or going forward, somebody could be trying to come up with a plan to make it better, make it right, make everything right. Get yours, get your, okay, Nas just came to me. I'm sorry. Nas just came to me. Second childhood? Nas, yeah, second childhood. Um, From the Stillmatic album. That was produced by DJ Premier. What's up with all these DJs coming up? Make everything right. Okay, anyway. So we have tests and trials. Look at the tests and trials right here. Somebody is stressed. Somebody is stressed. Okay. Oh, gosh. Mm -hmm. We have crossing the threshold in the two o'clock position. Either somebody did too much or somebody needs to walk away. Could be both. But I'm picking up somebody, somebody did too much. Somebody's been doing too much. Okay. You need somebody, there's a divine feminine that needs to go ahead and flip mode. Go flip mode on somebody. Or maybe you already have. Maybe you already have. Somebody needs to heal. Mm -hmm. We have the entitled prince in the three o'clock position. Who, who, who feeling like this? Somebody feels like they have every right. I don't know what's going on here in the background, but whatever a masculine has been doing, he's doing it because he feels like he has every right to. I got every right to do this. But you don't though, you really don't because you need to let it go. There's a masculine that needs to let that shit go. The activist is in the four o'clock position. Either a masculine told a man, right? 
Let me let me let me reword that. A man told a ma a man told another masculine to let it go. Break the chain. Free yourself. Okay. That is, that's either bad advice or good advice. I'm also picking up somebody's been laughing at you. Like either either laughing at you or somebody, you know. Somebody wants to make you laugh. Somebody wants to cheer you up. This could be the case as well. Either somebody was laughing at you or somebody wants to cheer you up. It could be both. Because Sekhmet as wouldn't, she wouldn't have come out for no reason. She wouldn't have come out for no reason. I'm also picking up, somebody thinks you're a joke, Divine Feminine. I don't know, maybe you did put somebody in their place. And, and, and what had happened was they laughed at you. I'm getting a whole bunch of twofold messages. Take this however it resonates. But again, the activist telling another, to, the activist telling a masculine to free yourself, that could be either a good thing or a bad thing. From the activist to the comedian to the integration to somebody saying, you know what, man, I, I, I really, I really want to see divine feminine right now. I really do. I want to see divine feminine. Okay. I just heard, ooh, I just heard that bitch reliable. That bitch, I, I swear I just heard it. In a far distant, somehow I said, that bitch reliable. <laughs> I don't know who's, I don't know who's having a conversation about you, Divine Feminine, but I feel like it could be men. It, I feel like there's men, a masculine and his friend and family member, they're talking about you and they're saying that bitch reliable. We have the inventor. Invent. This is in the eight o'clock position, sitting, sitting between strategist and wizard. Somebody's trying to come up with a plan, come up with a way. Strategist, inventor, and wizard. Somebody's trying to come up with a plan. Somebody's trying to manifest you. Behind the scenes, they're trying to look. The wizard is the wizard, baby. The wizard is in Sagittarius. Come on. Somebody name start with a W. I just saw a W. Okay. But the wizard is trying to come up with a plan. We have final approach. Yeah, they're gonna try to. They're gonna try again. Somebody's gonna try again. Final approach in the 10 o'clock position. We got the constant rescuer. Somebody is saying they want to be there. Somebody is saying, I want to be there. I want to be there for divine feminine is what somebody is saying. Again, masculine is receiving advice, but we don't know that could be a good thing or a bad thing. Okay. Look at the diplomat. Look at the look at the the shake the shake the shaking hands. In the twelve, somebody made a deal with the devil. Somebody made a bad deal. They ship on it, and it was just a bad deal. Woo! It was just a bad deal. And now there's a masculine feeling like this with these with with, with these here tests and trials. You know what? I can. Oh gosh. Segment. Segment as appeared unto me about two, three days ago in my bathroom sink. And she didn't, she wasn't supposed to fall out the deck. These two flipped over. I don't know how the hell she just, she just jumped out. The red lady. Okay, let's go around the clock with some feminine energies. 
So now at the bottom, we have the goddess of discernment. She says, I spend my time wisely. I only say yes when it's a holy hell yes. Absolutely. I love this card. I spend my time wisely. I ain't about to sit here and waste my time on you. Undecisive ass. You got to check in with your phone in order to make decisions with your dumb ass. Is what is is what somebody is saying. So feminines, we have the red goddess. It's a lot of red out here. But it's okay because we're in Aries energy right now. We got Sekhmet. She's the red lady. Lolita is the red goddess. Come on. We got the queen of saintly women, the goddess of devotion, the empress of protection, the goddess of magic. Woo we got the presence of the divine feminine. Quit playing with me. We got the goddess of eternal flame, the warrior of light, the mother of what? Imams, imams. We got Fatima, okay? We got the joy permeated mother, we got the Lady of the Lotus Born and Khadijah, the Mother of Believers. Let me sip on this here water before I go around this here table because <laughs> segment ass came out. Honor the deities around you. She popped up. Okay. Madonna, because I was listening to Madonna the other day. I love Madonna. Open your heart to me, baby. I hold the lock and you hold the key. Open your heart to me, baby. Okay. All right. Let's break all of this down. Wow. I just heard another song. I just heard, I'll keep holding on. I'll keep holding on. So somebody's going to hold on to this connection here. Even though there may be a disconnection right now, somebody's going to hold on. Okay, we have Isis, the goddess of magic. Okay, it says, it says sexual energy is sacred. My pleasure is a prayer that brings me back to life. So yeah, so this is what's going on. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Damn. Somebody had failed. Somebody failed. The test and the trial, somebody was trying to get some. That's what happened. So somebody, okay, so masculine came in with the intentions is just trying to get some from you. Unbeknownst to his ass that you the whole high priestess and divine feminine out here. So he couldn't fool you. And because he couldn't fool you, somebody done got in his ear and said, man, let that shit go, yo. Just let that shit go. Somebody say you ain't gonna never go, you ain't gonna never get that. Isis, look at Isis. Somebody could be playing with magic here too. Playing with it. Because when you got the, the goddess of magic with the test and the trials, somebody is playing. There's somebody playing with magic out here. Somebody needs to be careful in the two o'clock position. Look at the presence of the divine feminine. So yeah, divine masculine has to cross that threshold. He got to grow up. There's a call to change. He wants you, but he know he got to climb. He got to climb. Come on, he got to climb up for you. This ain't no little ass regular chick. You ain't no, re you ain't no regular ass chick. You ain't no little karmic that you can easily be lied to. And this is what he was hoping for. Let me find out this mask and then went in thinking that your ass was stupid. Oh. Okay. The presence of the whole divine feminine. She says, at the center of everything, there is light. And I am that light. Quit playing. 
okay? In the two o'clock position. Divine Feminine shows up in the two. We move on to the three o'clock to see the Empress of Protection. I am safe, I am divinely protected, I am held in love at all times. This is Our Lady of Guadalupe. She's so pretty. Okay, and so look at the entitled prince. Somebody is like, yo, I mean, you know, you ain't gonna give me none, word. The entitled prince is like, oh, you ain't gonna give me none? Hell no, she ain't gonna give you none. Shit. Look at Bridget. Bridget says the goddess of eternal frame. I almost said frame. Okay, um, yeah, so there's a masculine who likes your body. Masculine loves your body, divine feminine. He's looking at you like I love her frame is what he's saying. Anyway, this says I am an eternal flame and each day my life grows brighter. So y'all are shining right now. Look at Bridget. I'm picking up divine feminine. You are shining right now. It's like every time this masculine sees you, you look different. You know, you're in your uh, blow up and glow up. And so now that he sees you, now there's a masculine saying, you know what? Maybe I should stop messing with Carmen. Because ain't no way in hell I'm about to just let Divine Feminine roam these streets looking that damn good. And I'm not a part of that. And I'm not with that. That's what he's saying. It's 357 right now. That's a whole gun. Somebody feels like they have a shot. Or somebody feels like they failed. Like they only had one shot and they failed. Somebody feels like they messed it up. Because you probably won't give them a, another chance. Moving on to the five o'clock, we have the warrior of light. Oh, yeah, you ain't, yeah. Somebody is out here coming in like this. Look at masking and coming in with jokes. Kick in with you and shit. Nah, you ain't, <laughs> what? What? Nah. Joan of Arc says, I have still like faith in myself. The angels, the angels armor me with conviction, suited and booted, quit playing. He thinks shit is a joke with you. Let me find out. Masculine swear up and down it's a joke with you right now, feminine. He taking you for a joke, divine feminine. Ooh, that's not what you do. He think it's a game with you. Or maybe he's just trying to play you. You know what? Yeah, like I said, I feel like um, there's a feminine energy. Somebody wants to... Um, Somebody got something to say to masculine. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody got something to say. I feel like there's a feminine who's about to put a masculine in his place, but I feel like you, I, I'm strongly picking up you shouldn't though. Like even though you want to, don't. Just pray on a situation and heal. Because if you if you come, if you say something to this masculine, it's gonna become worse. Cause he's only gonna, he, it, He's going to laugh at you or there's going to be people around and, and they're going to make it, they're going to make you feel like a joke. Like, okay, so it says here, integration, coupled with the queen of Saint says, I am in service of divine love. I move the way love asks me to move. And this is a beautiful energy because this is what masculine is you are what masculine is praying for. You are what masculine seeks. But but he doesn't know that yet. I feel like there's a masculine who didn't give a feminine the chance. Like a masculine didn't get to know you as he should. The kind of woman this masculine is praying for, they've already found. And this is you. It's just that. They're surrounded by all of these other energies that are saying, nah, scratch that. Let that shit go. Let that feminine go. It's too much to get with her is what, is what somebody is putting in masculine's ear. It's too much to get with divine feminine. But you are what they seek. You are what they seek. Mm -hmm. Let's jump over here to Parvati because she, she, she's standing out right now. So it says here, the goddess of devotion coupled with the wizard. Very beautiful. Very beautiful. 
And it says, I am a love that doesn't leave. Woo! When I commit to love, my soul evolves. The goddess of devotion. Let me say that again. I am a love that doesn't leave. So masculine, this is either going on right now or this will happen in the near future. A masculine energy is going to, this masculine is going to try to summon you back summon you to come back and this time around he's going to make sure that you don't leave he's going to make sure that he does everything in his power to keep your ass around because he knows that you are worthy let's go to seven seven says okay so seven we have the strategist right we got fatima fatima says love is my lineage and gratitude is my religion there's something here about religion, religion, religious practices, religious differences, Fatima. I love this card. Look at Fatima. Very, very beautiful. Okay. Love is my lineage. She's in a seven o'clock with the strategist. So somebody has a plan. Somebody has a plan. The plan is to, wow. This could be both for masculine and feminine. No, this message that I'm getting ready to tell you, it could, it could, go, it could go for either one of y'all. Divine feminine, you could also have somebody in your ear as well telling you who they feel is right for you and it has to do with religious practices. Somebody is telling you, you need to be with your own. Mm. Somebody could be telling you, you need to be with your own. You need to be with your own kind. You need somebody from your own religion is what somebody is telling you, divine feminine, or somebody is telling masculine this. You need to be with somebody who shares the same religious as you. That's the plan. That's the goal. Somebody is saying, I want you to marry someone, you know, and, and, and don't get me wrong. It's, it's beautiful because yes, you're supposed to be, you know, that, that's if you want that divine kind of relationship where y'all can pray together and all of that. That's very old school. It is very old school. Where people, you know, you want to be with somebody who you're evenly yoked with. But, 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 I have heard of successful relationships where two people don't come from the same religious background and it works. Because they fell in love as they are with one another. They fell in love as they are. So why change is what I'm picking up. Why change? So again, when it comes to the masculine, we have a call to change. Somebody had, somebody pressured divine masculine to change, to change his mind because of religious practices. When we move on to the eight o'clock position, we have, again, we have the inventor. This is the masculine energy inventor. But then we have Ananda Mai. Ananda Mai Ma. She's the joy permeated mother. She says, I am my own guru. I know the self that never changes. Be self. Woo, I love it. This is somebody here who, this is a feminine energy who, just be yourself. This is how she comes. She comes as herself. She doesn't have to change anything about herself. But I feel like there's somebody here who could be saying to Divine Feminine, reinvent yourself. Yes, do change. Please do. Do change. Reinvent yourself. But now I just heard, don't make me over. Don't make me over. Don't make me over. I am who I am as I am. And if two people fell in love as they are, without knowing anything about each other, without knowing what religious practices, you know, and, or none of that, then let that love blossom and grow. The love in itself is the seed. The joy permeated mother says, I know myself and that will never change. I will never change who I am for nobody.
Yeah. That's deep. <laughs> Let's move on to the 10 o'clock. 10 o'clock says, the lady of the Lord is born. And she says embodiment is the, is, is the deepest bliss. My body was made for enlightenment. Yeah, somebody just wants, somebody just wants to have sex. Somebody loves your body. Somebody loves, 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 loves your body. Absolutely, they love your body, but now they're realizing that they ain't gonna never explore that body because they fucked up. They didn't give you a chance. Feminine, this is either you, you probably didn't give Max a chance, somebody was in your ear, or vice versa. Masculine didn't give feminine a chance. Somebody here talked too damn much. Okay? Telling people everything about everybody. Allowing other people to come in and cloud their judgment with all them damn opinions. So I feel like going forward, somebody is going to try to come back around just so they can get some. Moving on and moving strong towards the 11 o'clock position, we got the constant rescuer, right? This is the masculine energy, but then we have Khadijah, mother of believers. She says, I am spiritually and financially abundant, okay? <laughs> Woo! Hold on, I thought I was getting ready to say spiritually and wonderfully made. Uh-uh, she said, I am spiritually and financially abundant, Tanti. I provide heaven and earth for myself. I don't need you, is what she said. You sitting up here, oh, I get it now. Oh, let me sip on these here waters. Hold on, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. Hold on, I gotta kick my feet up for this one. Let me kick my feet up. Oh boy, I get it. Woo! Somebody made terrible assumptions about you. Dear old people, because I know ain't nothing but over 18 year olds watching me. Listen, when you have made a connection with a whole other person, embrace it, cherish it, grow it. You get to know that person. What the fuck does your friend or anybody else in your world got to do with that connection that you have with that special person? They're not the ones in the mix. They're not the ones getting to know them. They're not the ones. They don't know your person. So why listen to people who don't know your person? Beautiful energy right now. Check it. Hold on. What's going on is this. Somebody made it seem like divine feminine only only wants money. Somebody told divine masculine, don't, don't fuck with her. She look like she don't got much either. You probably going to have to rescue her all the damn time. And you probably, she probably going to be asking you for money all the damn time. And she probably needy as hell. She probably clingy and shit. Nah. <laughs> nah okay I am spiritually and financially abundant I provide heaven and earth for me I don't need you fuck out of here look at the time the time says look at that the time says 1609 it's 409 on 409 You ever see somebody who look broke? You ever see a broke person not need nobody? <laughs> you ever see somebody who just look like they ain't got shit, but, but they don't ask for nothing? Don't sleep on that person. Please don't sleep on that person. Okay? I hate when people assume that women just want money. Motherfucker, I don't want your shit. I feel like cussing. I'm mad at this divine masculine right here. I, I really do. I feel like cussing this masculine out. I don't want your shit. I could be broken, homeless, and I still won't ask you for shit because I already know your mentality. I know your mindset. The minute I ask you for a fucking helping hand, you gonna think, oh, this a needy bitch. No. 
And this is why women are strong as fuck nowadays. This is what makes a, a woman become independent. The, the, a man's mentality when she needs a helping hand. Motherfucker, I don't want your money like that. I ask for your paycheck. Damn. And then masculines feel some type of way because we are here women. Women are out here winning, is what I meant to say. Lolita, the red goddess, she says, playfulness is a spiritual power. Laughter leads me back to light. She ain't playing. She's not, she's in a hangman position. She's not playing with the... Somebody, masculine made a deal with the devil. He shook hands on it. Let me find out. I hope this wasn't a bet. I hope this wasn't a bet that let me find out sitting up here betting on divine feminine how much you want bet i'll hit that how much you want bet i'll hit that before the month is over because this is how men talk this is how they talk how much you want bet i'll hit that at th before 30 days how much you want bet and then and then and then bets are off because divine feminine ain't stupid she out here in these streets look the divine feminine but she the high priestess as well she already know. So when you get Lolita the Red Goddess in the 12 o'clock position, playfulness is a spiritual power, she's not playing. And, okay, on the other hand, she played you. You know what? I'll keep holding on. I'll Keep holding on. I'll keep holding on. Yeah, this table look crazy. Yeah, this table looks crazy. I can't fit nothing else. I can't fit nothing else on this table. The mindset of these ninjas out here. The mindset of these ninjas. It'd be terrible. It'd be just assuming that all females are the same. We are not. We are not the same. I be one broke bitch, man. I won't ask you for shit. And that's not pride. It's just the fact that I know a man's mentality. The minute you ask a man for a little bit of help, that should have turned into other shit. Oh, what you gonna do for me? You wanna do? You want? You feel like doing something strange for a little change? No, fuck out my face. The minute you ask a man for a little bit of help, that shit turned into other shit. What you gonna do for me? So, what divine feminines do is that when we need help, we just go through it. Fuck it. It is what it is. Listen, man, I'm gonna go through this here struggle alone because I already know how men do. Okay. All right, now, let's move on. Father, no, mm -mm, not these. Let's go here. Let's go to the blind deck. What's the current situation at hand between masculine and feminine? What is really going on? What is really going on? I'll keep holding on. Is this the one? This is what's going on. Both are questioning. Masculine and feminine are questioning each other. Is this the one? But rather than get to know each other, they're asking the wrong people. They're going out, they're asking other people, is this the one? I don't know, you tell me. Go get to know the person and then come back and tell me, are they the one? Shit, fuck, I don't know. I don't know your person to tell you if they're the one. You gotta find that shit out for yourself. Feminine for your own good. Stay away from masculines who put their friends first. Stay away from mas stay away from people because some of y'all same sex, right? I don't know how you roll. 
But however you roll, stay away from people who put their friends first, who gotta check in with the group first. Stay away from those. Those are not for you. This is what's going on between the two of y'all. You're both questioning each other's uh, position. Okay, is this the one? That's what's going on. This is the mutual energy between divine masculine and feminine. Give me one for masculine, please. Oh, masculine is not happy without you, feminine. Right there. Mm-hmm. And then give me one for the feminine. Are they trying to set me up? Damn, feminine, you don't trust shit. But, I mean, I don't blame you. I really don't. I don't blame you. You don't trust masculine. You really don't. Because he trusts in the group. He got a lot of shit going on. Hold on. Where is he? Give me the animal. Give me the untamed spirit. Let's get the animal oracle. Untamed spirit. Let's go to the untamed. I just heard don't do that no more. Wow. I just heard. I just heard I won't. What? I either heard don't do that no more or I won't do that no more. Don't do that no more is what I keep hearing. All right. Let's go to the spirit oracle. I mean, the animal. Speak to me, Father God, what's going on? It's a lot. Oh, boy. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Listening in secrecy. I don't like this. Somebody is mad and mature. I'm picking up on a grown ass immature man. Oof. This is the kind of man that'll tell all your secrets, divine feminine. Don't tell this masculine shit. Or, hold on, twofold message, twofold message, twofold message. I'm also getting um somebody wants to. Somebody wants to know all your secrets or listening in secret, like eavesdropping type of shit. All right, Father God, speak to me, please. And we have the salmon. Salmon is the resilience. It's the life cycle. It's like having nine lives. Being able to heal and come and, and then and then becoming a better version of yourself every time. Every time something happens and you gotta heal from that. You come out stronger and better. The salmon is 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 look, it's looking at the two o'clock. It's facing two o'clock. So this is about divine feminine. Masculine is looking at divine feminine like, wow. You're different now. Wow, you're different. Wow, look at you. Joy and companionship. Oh, now you want to hang out. Uh-uh. Hell no. Hell no. Hell no. So a masculine decides that he wants to hang out with you now after the fact, now that you're doing better. So he couldn't be your friend when you were down. He couldn't be your friend when you were going through something. I don't know how this resonates, but this is how it's coming to me. Who met a divine masculine or feminine when you when, when, when they were going through some shit and they couldn't even stick around long enough to fucking be a friend to be there? Somebody probably got in their ear, somebody probably got in their ear and said they going through nah, they got too many issues. Nah, fuck that. Don't don't talk to them. Don't talk to that person no more. They got too much shit going on. Don't we all have issues though? Let me find out. Everybody got issues at some point. (sighs) 
Let me find. Mm. 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 All right. Let's lay them down. Anaconda. We got the uniqueness. We got the dance and meditation. We got the horse. We got the badger, the seahorse, the wolf. We got the owl, the moth, the lynx, the golden eagle, and the wild goose. Didn't I just tell your ass somebody don't do shit but trust in the group? Ooh, I told you this. Somebody don't do shit but trust in the group. This is in the 11 o'clock position. They, they tell their friends everything. They tell their friends everything. Somebody can't keep their mouth shut. Divine Feminine, you need to be careful. This masculine is pissing me off. He talked too much. Don't tell this masculine shit about your life. Other than the basics. If that. They don't do shit but tell everybody. They trust in the group. Communication. You know what? Nah. You know what? I want shit. Me, I will walk away from this masculine. Let me get me a... I need a refill. Hold on. I'll walk away from that. I can't stand men that talk too fucking much. Honey, I don't hang around females because they talk too fucking much. You mean to tell me that masculine is going to come in on some bitch shit? Nah, I cut that shit off ASAP. Come on. Mm-mm. Nope. We have determination in the one o'clock energy. Look at the badger. Mm -hmm. Mental energy. One o'clock was, was that position where we had the test and trials card. Determination, mental energy. So now somebody's determined. Somebody's determined to make everything right. Woo, get yours, get yours. Second childhood. Somebody wants a somebody wants a second chance. Masculine wants a second chance. You're the man. Still mad it. You're the man. You're the man. Let me find out. Masculine is determined for a second chance. Cause he know he fucked up. So going on into the, the, the two o'clock position, we got fatherly power. The seahorse. Woo! Yeah. This is where masculine grows up. This is where masculine grows the fuck up. Fatherly power, constancy, the seahorse. Mm-hmm. Moving on to the three o'clock journey, ambition, the horse. Oh, he gonna chase you. He's definitely going to chase you. He's going to chase you now, Divine Feminine. Going into the 4 o'clock, we got the wolf. Instinct and loyalty. And when he catch your ass, because the horse, the horse is running. Okay? The horse is running in the 3 o'clock. When we get to the 4, we no longer have a running kind of energy. We just have the wolf. We just have somebody that is now walking with you. Instinct and loyalty. So masculine wants to walk with you. They want to be your friend now and they want to be a loyal friend to you. We have owl in the five, vision and silence. Watching you, straight watching you when, when, when you're not even looking, you don't even know. This masculine could be stalking, but I'm just picking up just watching you in silence. Everything you do, but also falling falling in love with it too. Like falling in love with you. Just watching you be yourself. As I say that, watching you be yourself. Uniqueness, freedom in the six. Watching you just be yourself. Moving quietly and, they, and they're falling in love with you. Look at the seven o'clock with the moth. Change in dreams. Yeah. 
This is where masculine makes a decision. This is where masculine says, nah, I don't want to be with the person that the group has chosen for me. I want divine feminine. I like divine feminine. I like her lifestyle. I love her style. I love her period. I just love, I, I want divine. That's what somebody is saying here. When we move to the eight o'clock, we got the links, invisibility and revelation. Seeing right through somebody. Seeing right through somebody. Come on. Moving on to the nine o'clock, we have dance and meditation. We got the crane. Mm -hmm. Yep. Enlightenment and success with the golden eagle. This is in the 10 o'clock. Mm. Somebody loves your body. Somebody look, they're looking at you like you have the body of a dancer. Somebody thinks you're very sexy. Enlightenment and success in the 10 o'clock. You shine. The golden eagle. The golden eagle. You go from the crane. Look at they're all birds. Look at the look at the crane. But then the crane, right? And then you have a, a flying eagle right here. Somebody's gonna receive a phone call. Wow, I gotta put, there's a, hold, hold on. Wait a minute. Somebody's gonna receive a phone call. Somebody's gonna receive a phone call. Between two and four. Between 2 and 4 a.m. or p.m. Or somebody's going to receive a phone call in 24 hours. I don't know why I could leave. But I, I'm, just, I'm just getting vision. Somebody's going to receive a phone call from either a Taurus, a Gemini, or a Cancer energy. That's not for everybody, but somebody's going to receive a phone call. I'm also picking up somebody's coming towards you. Somebody's coming towards you. Between today and the 11th, that is not for everybody, but it's just what I'm picking up. Somebody wants to make everything right. Woo! Get yours, get yours, get yours. Okay. Um, Somebody wants to make it right. Somebody needs to clarify something. I'm also picking up. Somebody wants to be a Superman. I don't know. I, 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 I'm just getting. I'm getting visions and um, intuitive messages right now. I'm not even looking at the. I'm not looking at the clock no more. I'm, I'm just kind of looking at my ceiling. Um. Yeah. Somebody wants to come in like they're Superman. Somebody wants to rescue you. Or maybe they feel like they failed in that, and so they want to kind of apologize. All right, let me get back to this table. All right, so anaconda, camouflage, and imbalance. Mm -hmm. Hiding something. There's an imbalance here. In the 12 o'clock. Camouflage. Yeah, the snake is in the damn 12. This is what they get. Somebody hung themselves. Mm -hmm. Open your heart to me, baby. I hold a lock and you hold a key. Open your heart to me. Baby, I fell in love with you. Does it go like that? I think I'm just filling in the blanks because I don't know the words. What? You hold the key. Something goes on. I'm, I, I, I see an arrow. The arrow is shooting in the right direction from left to right. Something goes on. Something moves forward. All right, let's see what else comes out. What other deck did I pull out? Oh, God. 
gosh. I had to, I went in my card stash and pulled out all the old cards that I had stashed in there. So I'm just going to go around. I haven't used this deck in years. I think the last time I used this deck right here, I had just started my channel. Um, well, let's see what happens. It says, spend your time on someone who's worth it. Don't waste it on you. See what I'm saying? There's, there's, a, there's, a, there's a thing here about wasting your time. Don't waste your time. Just please, just to stop wasting. Just stop just. Divine Feminine, can you stop wasting your time? Just stop wasting your time on these people. Stop wasting your time, honey. This could be Divine Master wasting his damn time. But it says it. It says it clearly. Spend your time on somebody who's worth it. Don't waste it on ridiculousness. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. <laughs> Listen, man. Let me get up. Open your heart. Open your heart for what? They ain't trying to open up shit. They trying to sleep with you. Madonna, my ass. They trying to sleep with you. That's it. What's behind? What? What? Oh, that fell out? Okay. All right. Okay, so what's this? This says help people. Ooh. This is what masculine failed to do. <laughs> Help people. Give back. Do good shit for humanity. Do unto others and you will have people do unto yourself. But they failed to do that. Somebody needed help here. And a selfish ass masculine failed to do that because somebody got in his ear and said, yo, man, chill. No, she get, no, she needs, she got issues. She already coming off as clingy. No, if you help her now, you're going you're gonna to have to keep helping her. No, that's not the case. Somebody really needed help. Help people give back, do good shit for humanity. The back say, get over yourself, pull your shit together. Okay. Yeah, I don't like this. And I don't like this masculine. It's like my stomach. It's, it's like my stomach wants to turn. Okay, let's just go ahead and lay them down and pull up because we're trying to get really, you know, we're trying to really get this message across. Oof. Excuse me. Rebel. Rebel. That's song by Lauren Hill, Rebel. Rebel, Rebel, however you want to put it, but damn it, look. Don't get laid. It says, loosen the fuck up. Control freaks, don't get laid. This is what somebody wanted you to do. This is, this is somebody's message. I feel like this is what masculine is saying to you. Divine Feminine, loosen the fuck up. Control freaks don't get laid. So Divine Masculine is, is, is saying to you, Divine Feminine, use a control freak. Why are you trying to control everything? Or this could be vice versa. This could be Divine Masculine trying to control shit. And this is why he ain't getting them from you, Divine Feminine. This is why the snake is in the 12. Take it how it resonates. You equals a tight ass. Somebody is saying you're uptight. Somebody's uptight here. Somebody is saying, I see why your ass is still single. But they're saying it, they're, they're not, mm. Yeah, I don't like this energy. Somebody's a narcissist. All right. Couple with the badger, it says, everyone has their turn. Welcome to yours. Gather your tired ass up and handle it. Ooh. With the determination and the mental energy. Ooh. Divine feminine, divine masculine is flipping on you. He said, everybody got their turn. Welcome to yours. Gather your tired ass up and handle it. 
Divine masculine is pretty much saying, look, feminine, if you want me, <laughs> shit, you won't have to jump on this. You won't have to catch me when you can because I gave you your turn and you didn't handle it. And because you didn't handle it, because you won't be all tight ass, and because you want to sit here and get to know people and take a little sweet ass time and all that, because you coming in with self-respect, you know what? You missed you miss your turn. Now it's somebody else's turn. By divine feminine. It's what divine. It, listen, this listen to me. This is what's going on right now. These are the masculine's words unto you. Again, keep in mind that he's being influenced by negative energy. He's being influenced by friends and possibly family members. Somebody is saying to you, what do you want, Divine Feminine? Are you looking for a relationship or are you trying to get laid? Because if you're just trying to get laid, listen, I don't got time for all of that. Come over here and handle it. But Divine Feminine, you're too good for that. Because at the end of the day, it's about self-respect. And you know that if you jump on that thing like that, they're not going to respect you. And so you walk. You walk. You move the fuck on. <laughs> you move on. That's what it says on this here card. You move on. You probably can't see it because of the sun. But it say on this card, don't take 12. Take one, maybe two. But just move on. Didn't I tell you somebody somebody had a shot? It says here, take a shot. Somebody missed that shot. Somebody moves on. In the four o'clock, come on. In the two o'clock, it says, seriously, just do it. Seriously, just do it. Fatherly power. Okay. It says, fuck, apologize. Somebody, yeah, father power. So I know many of y'all are saying, okay, this can't be mad. This can't be divine masculine because had he been divine masculine, indeed, he wouldn't be on this, on this fuck boy shit. But just keep in mind that this divine, he's divine masculine because he has a good heart. He has that kind of heart. It's just that he's being in, this is heart versus mind with this masculine right now. Because he's, he does have a level of immaturity where, where he's allowing, you know, negative influences to cloud his judgment. But your absence is what's going to grow his ass up. Because he goes from immaturity to that fatherly power. When the masculine becomes the fatherly power, that's when he grows the fuck up. And now, seriously, just do it. Fucking apologize. I'm also picking up because the fatherly power is in the two. I feel, I'm also picking up that sooner or later, once masculine realizes that his friends ain't shit and they're they not going to really steer him in the right direction, I feel like he's going to... Uh, Look for a mature fatherly figure to get advice from going forward. That's what I'm picking up. I feel like after this masculine realizes he lost you, because again, you shining right now. And every time he sees you around, you won't look better and better. And this is that shit that's all cat his ass chasing you. So sooner or later, he's going to realize, damn. What did I do? Look at what the fuck I just let go of listening to these assholes over here. You know what? I'm not going to listen to them no more. So now masculine is, gonna, is, is trying to figure out how to apologize to you because he knows he was wrong. Okay. Moving on, couple with the horse. It says you need some fucking time alone and you know why, okay? It says don't talk to anyone, don't look at anyone. Yeah, 
with the journey and ambition, yeah, you need some time alone and you know why. Somebody needs some time alone. I'm just picking up, I'm just, I'm, I'm, somebody needs to, yeah, somebody just doesn't feel like it at this point. Yeah. Moving on to the five o'clock, couple with the owl, it says, now is not the time. It's not the time right now. It's not the time. Look at the vision and the silence. It's not the time. Somebody's trying to rush the process. It's not the time. It says, whatever you are thinking about, don't do it. Okay. So there's something here about timing. Timing is, 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 is everything. Timing is everything. Timing is everything. Mm -hmm. Heart versus mind. Somebody's trying to figure out when's the right time to come in and apologize. When we move on to the six o'clock, right? Coupled with the uniqueness and freedom, it says, wake up, you are missing some cool shit. Stop sleeping so damn much. So yeah, somebody, somebody's gonna go into, you know, um, Somebody's going to start to live a little bit, have fun. Somebody's going to start having fun, but I feel like this is where they start having fun alone. Because you have your uniqueness and you have your freedom. And you're not about to miss out on anything cool. You about to go out there and have you some fun. You ain't, your ass ain't going to be in the house sleeping. You, you ain't going to be in the house. <laughs> and I feel like this is where masculine is. Somebody's going to be like, damn, I wish I could be over there. I wish I could be with feminine right now. Moving on to the seven, coupled with the moth, that says, get after that shit. The world has your back. So there's something that has to be done. That project, that person, that idea is waiting with the dreams. Handle it. Do it. Okay, moving on to the, to the um, eight o'clock, coupled with the links, we have give zero fucks. Zero. You are giving too many fucks. Give zero and move on. That's it. When we move on to the crane in the nine o'clock where we have dance and meditation, it says no one wants to listen to that shit. Complaining makes you weak. You have the strength to change the world, so do it. Behind it, it says stop fucking whining. Exactly. Somebody didn't want to hear it. Somebody didn't want to hear it. Let me find out. It was it was very simple. Maybe this has to do with just like a simple conversation. Maybe you somebody made a phone call. Maybe somebody just wanted to just have a friend to talk to at the time. And somebody was very selfish in that moment. Somebody, you know, in that moment, somebody may have said, yo, I, don't, I ain't trying to hear that shit. I'm just trying to have some fun. I'm just trying to get out here and dance, yo. I don't want to hear that shit. Fuck what you going through. But come on. If you're really trying to get to know each other and build a friendship, you're going to have to be there as a friend. Newsflash, you're going to have to. Otherwise, what the fuck is a friendship if I can't lean on you and you can't lean on me? Huh? So I guess you just want to be a party friend? Golden Eagle says, forgive and let that shit go and continue to focus on your enlightenment and success. This is you, Divine Feminine, and somebody comes towards you to try to apologize. Go ahead. Forgive them and then let that shit go. Behind it, it says shame, regret, and guilt. Those are just some, sh some bullshit. Shame, regret, and guilt. That's just some bullshit. Just keep it moving. This person wants to go and party and you know bullshit and dance and all of that you focused on your enlightenment and success you focusing on that money this is in the this is in capricorn's house and you out here having fun by yourself you know what with the wild goose it say it says get some give some it will cheer your ass up love Get some, give some, it will cheer your ass up. 
This is coupled with trust in the group, communication. But you can't give some and get some if you can't trust. You have to be able to trust this person. It's simple as that. Because as adults, right, a lot of people as adults, you can just go out there and just see whoever you want. When we set this reading off, I said to you, let me put on this glove because no glove, no love. Not even knowing that this message was going to resonate to, with, with, with everything else. Somebody wants you to just dive right the hell in. Not saying dive in without protection. What I'm saying is, you dive in because you're grown and you feel like you can and you, okay, so you have your protection and you do you, but can you trust this person to shut the fuck up? How do you know you're not sleeping with somebody who gonna run tell that to the friend? Yo, I had her like this. Yeah, I had her like that. Yo, she did this to me. Yo, nah. That's that shit right there. That'll make a bitch make a phone call. Yo, if it gotta be, it gotta be. I don't know about you, but that to me is disrespect. Because you're supposed to be two grown consenting adults. And as adults, you shouldn't have to lay down all the tedious rules to this shit. You don't kiss and tell. But somebody still has that level of immaturity. They may have a good heart, but they still have that level of immaturity because they trust in the group. They do what the group do. So you have a masculine, very immature masculine here that's 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 looking at feminine like, yo, this is why you this why your fucking ass is still single. I guess this why you don't get none. You had your turn. You had I don't know what what window. Let me find out. I feel the need to say window because I feel like this is what masculine is saying. Yo, it's like he's saying, bitch, I gave you a window. And within that window, you ain't do shoot, you ain't do shit but call and try to boo-hoo and cry to me about what the fuck you got going on. And I'm not here for that. I'm here to get laid. Now, if you don't take advantage of that window right there to get the D, I'm sorry to inform you, but your time's up. Next. That's a hardcore reality, feminine. <laughs> it is what it is out here. There's nothing wrong with what you're doing. It's just that somebody still has a fuckboy mentality because they run with fuckboys. But they actually have a good heart and it's gonna take your absence, it's gonna have it's gonna take for you to give zero for this person to grow up. And then it's gonna be up to you to accept the apology or not. Now, if they apologize, great. Go ahead and forgive and let that shit go and get and, and, and get back to your money because your money is out here looking very good. This is what we're dealing with here. Somebody trying to rush you. Somebody trying to tell you, oh, oh okay, well, shit, I guess you won't be getting no love. Okay. But it's not really a loss because had you slept with this person, Divine Feminine, your business will be out there in them streets. All the friends will know. Side note, my intuition is speaking to me. Side note, my intuition just spoke to me. This is what's this is this is what's going to okay. Mm. Divine Feminine. This immature masculine right here is going to go through 
this masculine is going to go through something. What's going to happen, I, pr I promise you, this just, this just came to me. Oh, my God. I promise you, listen. What's going to end up happening? This is not for everybody, but what's going to end up happening? This masculine in his damn immaturity, right? He's going to continue to move how he's been moving. Okay? He's going to treat. He's going to treat every female the same way. There's a window. He's going to give them a window. And if they don't act, if they don't spread them within that window, he's going to move on. But one of one of these people, one of these 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 women, these people, whether it's, I don't care, okay? You could be same sex, whatever, but masculine is going to end up sleeping with somebody and because he trusts in the group so much because he talked too much because he's going to go run tell that to the group this is what's going to happen somebody in his group is going to be like oh word oh you had her like that oh she did that to you word and they gonna sleep with her so masculine is going to set himself up talking about his sex life, talking about how he did women, how he did them and how they were and what they did. Masking is about to set himself up. He's going to tell the group how he slept with somebody and somebody within that group is going to be like, word? And they're going to come around and sleep with him too. And that, my dear friends, is what going to make this masculine grow the fuck up. That's what's going to be the hard, cold lesson. I got a whole entire sensation on my right foot. Masculine is about to go through some shit. And karma is going to ensue so hard that when this masculine is going through that and he needs somebody to talk to, somebody going to be like, yo, <laughs> no one wants to listen to that shit. Complaining makes you weak. What goes around... Always cometh back around. Because it's just certain shit you don't do. Certain shit you don't do. You don't treat everybody the same. People are not the same. Yes, a lot of people do the same shit, but people ain't the same. This is deep. This is deep. And masculine is going to be trying to come back around, talk about some. I want to apologize. When is the right time to apologize? Yep. Oh, feminine energy. <laughs> Oh, feminine energy. All right. Can we put some earrings on it, though? Can we put some? We have nine o'clock. Sagittarius energy with the dream killer. Yeah. So there's a dream killer. We have Sagittarius energy, but then we have a dream killer. Yeah, somebody is mad. Somebody's going to regret the fact that they allowed a dream killer to kill the dream, and the dream is you. They want a second chance. They want a second chance. Silent hater, yeah. Silent hater. This masculine has a silent hater in the group. They got a Judas in the group. And that Judas is going to be the one to betray them and sleep with their person. One of them anyway. Yeah. That's what's going to happen. Because you spill the tea. You don't spill bedroom tea. You keep that to yourself. That's grown folk business right there. That's how you gain trust. That's how you build the trust and the friendship. You will run tell that to all your friends and then wonder why your friends are always flirting with you, with who you with. You wonder why your friends are always trying to steal who you with. Come on. Stop telling your business. No wedding bells. Mm, 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 mm. 
No wedding bells. Yep, no wedding bells, honey. <laughs> mm. I'll never hear the bells if you leave me. I'll never hear the bells. I'll never. I don't know nothing about that. Anything else? Anything else? Any other earrings? Earrings. No more earrings are coming out. Oh, wait a minute now. We have 12 o'clock, hangman. We're holier than thou. Two o'clock and she rises not. Set you up energy. Trying to make somebody jealous. Trying to make somebody jealous. Mm -hmm. Somebody wants to prove that they are. Um, yeah, I feel like this masculine wants to come in to say, that's not who I am. I, he wants to say that. I, I'm sorry. That's, that's not who I am. That's really not who I am. There's a, there's a shiesty ass female. There's a shiesty ass female that doesn't want this um, feminine, I mean, that doesn't want masculine to be with the feminine. Anything else? Karmic? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That shit slid right off the damn. This felt, look, Karmic slid off the damn clock and onto the damn, on top of this deck. Let me see. Give me one for Karmic. Give me. We have the gorilla and the sea turtle longevity so leadership comes out okay so so the karmic wow so divine masculine kick karmic to the curb and decide to be you know take let's take matters into his own hands and be a leader about the situation and and it's now he wants longevity now he wants to take his time and shit with you divine feminine yeah mm -hmm. courage and humility Cause you humble. He sees you humble. He sees you beautiful, but he, but, but he doesn't, he doesn't see you out here like trying to get attention. He's actually, he sees you out here working. He sees you. Mm, 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 mm. Anything else out of this earring deck? What? Talking shit. Talking shit in line. Look at the Lion King. Talking mad shit. Yup. What's this right here? Something flipped over my hand. The robbery channel. Yup. Told you. Mm hmm Nothing else is coming out. No more earrings. Death scar. This shit is over. Some of y'all like, fuck this masculine. I don't give a fuck what he go through. Or what kind of changes he go through and shit to try to grow. Some of y'all... <laughs> So we all like, fuck this mask. Got time for that shit? I gotta get this coin, honey. That's what somebody was saying. Okay, and I don't blame you not one bit. Go ahead and forget and let that shit go move on. But just know that you're gonna have a stalker on your hands, cause he ain't trying to watch you, he ain't trying to watch you be with nobody else. Uh-huh. Them same friends that told him that to that told his ass to let you go are the same friends that are looking at you from the side, like, damn, she fine. Uh-huh. Yep. Trying to tell you. I'm about to clear this table and I'm gonna close with some soul messages. All right. Mm-hmm. I can't deal. I really can't. I can't deal. What? Here we go. Oh gosh. Mm -hmm. Ain't nothing worse. I promise you, ain't nothing worse. Ain't nothing worse than a telling ass man. I run tell that to everybody about what the fuck happened in the bedroom. And that shit is for the birds. That's that shit I hate. Not for real, for real. That's that shit. 
you know, I try to keep it cordial and I try to, you know, I try to, I try. What's that song? <laughs> yeah. Ooh, when you do that to Divine Feminine and you put all her sexual business out in the street like that, that's that shit that make a bitch want to fucking call somebody. You know, if it gotta be. That's cold. I call a motherfucker up. Listen, if it gotta be, it gotta be me. Yup, that motherfucker live right there. This is his motherfucking name and number. This is where that motherfucker work at, and this is what the fuck he said. Because it, because because what happens is that they're trying to ruin your reputation, and, and it's not even like that. If you're coming in as two grown consenting adults, then, you know, a, adults, though, then you should know that certain things don't need to be... You know what I'm saying? That shit tedious as hell. I gotta, I gotta sit here and write down the rules and regulations, motherfucker. Don't da -da 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 -da. sign right here, bitch. Matter of fact, let me find out. We gotta start coming up with contracts and shit. Okay, you know we'll do this, but sign the fuck right here, just in case she talk. I'm coming for that ass. That's that professional shit. Some of y'all might have to go professional. <laughs> I can't with y'all. Cause that's that shit that'll make me pick up the phone. Yo, if it gotta be, it gotta be, man. This motherfucker talking. I don't like that shit. And this is why some women just, they just don't. Some women, hey, you know what I mean? I just get money. I don't make friends, I make money. Um, where we at though? Oh, soul messages. That's why Sekhmet ass came out. Who's going through this? This is why Sekhmet ass came out. It's like a warning. It's like saying, be careful with this one. Don't tell this one all your business. Be careful with this one, because this one will put all your business out in the street and will have your fucking ass out here looking crazy, and you wondering why everybody all of a sudden is trying to have sex with you, and it's because somebody has spilled out all the damn beans as far as what the fuck y'all did in the bedroom. That's that bullshit. Make a bitch want to call somebody. Yo, if it got to be, it got to be. Father, let's do the soul messages around the clock and then I'm going to close. Mm -hmm. I love you just the way you are and I forgive you. These are the main messages. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. Excuse me. Mm, 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 mm. See what I'm saying? Didn't I tell you? All right, yeah, some of you are definitely going through this. And it's and I'm I already feel bad. I feel bad. I don't know who's going. Ooh. Yeah, somebody's going through this. <laughs> Somebody's going through this. I can't believe somebody really did you like this, the feminine. Like you really going through this? I was hoping that maybe you saved yourself from this situation. Maybe you saw it coming and you didn't. But for some of you, you actually did. For some of you, you already had sex with this person and it's already too late. Because in the sex house, Scorpio house, it says, I'm sorry I judged you for having sex with me too soon. Wow. This is a twofold message. Either some of you, you didn't go with the plan. You didn't have sex with this person because Scorpio was a death. Like for some of you, you cut this person off just in time because maybe you sensed that this was that type of person or you already went ahead and you slept with them and now they are misjudging you because they had sex with you too soon. Or you, right. So it's like... But it's supposed to be consenting adults, though. 
How could they judge you but not judge themselves? Okay, yeah, let me walk. I, 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 give me my orders. Give me, okay, yeah. I'm walking away from the table. I can't. Uh-uh. Nope. This is sad, divine feminine. They already to he talking about you. He judged you, divine feminine. Divine feminine, he judged you. And it was supposed to be a consenting adult type of thing. So he's judging you, but he's not judging himself. And then he's talking about, and then he's telling people, he's telling people you fast. They telling people that you you a fast one, that you easy and shit. Ooh, that ain't cool. That's not cool. It's not cool. I feel for you. Whoever you are, Divine Feminine, my heart goes out to you because... Oh, boy, oh, boy. Yep. Woo! This is deep. I, I don't know who you are. I don't know who's reading this is for, but I feel for you. I really do. Because that's exactly what's going on for some of you. For some of you, you went ahead, you went ahead and you took advantage of the you took advantage of the window. <laughs> you said, oh, okay. So you know it is what it is, but yeah, they shouldn't have judged you. So when it, it, I can't even say it. In the one o'clock. Right? Stuttering ass. It says, I'm sorry for the way I treated you. Somebody wants to apologize. I wasn't sure of my feelings at the time in the two. I chose the other person to please my family. In the three. So this masculine had an option. They had he had options. A lot of options. Clearly, clearly they did choose you they chose somebody else to please the family but regardless of how soon you may have slept with this person they're still thinking about you okay they still want to be more than just friends because they weren't they weren't sure of their feelings at the time okay in the five o'clock it says i'm in love with someone else this is the heart chakra so they may have chose somebody else to please the family, but their heart is not there. Their heart is not in that relationship. It says here in the six, I can't compete with your ex. Competition for what? Maybe this is how you feel, Divine Feminine? I don't know, but somebody feels this way. This is in Virgo's house. When we go to the seven o'clock, it says my life hasn't been the same without you. This is in Libra's house. I feel like, and this is in a seven again. We're in April now. Between now and July, I feel like y'all, y'all are not gonna be speaking. And 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 again, this is what's gonna grow this person. In the nine o'clock, it says, "I've been watching you for a very long time." Yes, I'm picking up on a stalker. Mm -hmm. In the ten, it says, "What you did is so unforgivable." Why am I not surprised? Somebody went out there and talked about you, judged you, misjudged you, come on. Without judging themselves? Why do I feel like I want to watch um, Fraternity Court? I used to watch that show nonstop on the daily. That was my shit. Why? Because... Lauren Lake will put both parties in their places. Somebody going to court? How does that resonate into this shit? Let me find out somebody going to court. Paternity court. Let me find out somebody going somebody to end up pregnant and it's not going to be masculine's baby. Let me find out. Because he's tell, he, he, he tells 
women's business so fucking hard to the group. Let me find out that baby ain't even gonna be his. It's gonna be one of his friend's babies. Since you like to tell your friends every fucking thing. Why is Lauren Lake popping up right now? How does that factor into this read? Divine, this masculine is going to have to go through a hard, cold lesson before he is, before he be, listen, before he could ever be worthy of stepping to you. He out there trying to play you like you are unworthy, but he ain't shit. He don't even come close to where he should be as a man to stand beside you. Quit playing. So now all of a sudden I can't see myself with anyone else, Doug. But you was out here talking about Divine Feminine like she was trash. To the group, Doug. In the 12, it says, I should have I should have told you there was, he didn't tell you there was somebody else. So he came, so, so, so he chased you, made you think that it would be something, didn't tell you that there was somebody else, possibly many and then kicked your ass to the curb once he got it. And not only that, but then told your business to them damn streets. That's a phone call for me. Yo, if it gotta be, it gotta be, man. How much you need? <laughs> Don't take that literally, okay? But maybe I shouldn't have said that, huh? That's that shit I make a bitch call somebody, yo. Let me tell you what this masculine is out here doing. Because you are a whole divine feminine out here. You grown. Don't fall for that shit. Stop falling for that shit. When a man come up to you and say, well, I mean, you know, we're both consenting adults. You're grown, I'm grown. What's, what, what? What's stopping us? You, you talk too fucking much. You, you know, they give you, they you think that it's okay, and then it's like they get it, and it's not okay. It's it's a game. Y'all know the game, and if you don't, I feel sorry for you. You should know the game already. Again, it's why I don't make friends. I make money. Friends talk too fucking much. I don't rock with females. They talk too fucking much. Then you got to deal with men talking too fucking much. I'm private out here. Fuck that. I'm going to take this shit to a whole new level and really come up with a fucking a personal contract. You will try to be my friend? Hold on, you try to be my friend in my personal world? Sign, read this shit. Read the fine print. If you agree, sign right the fuck there and date it. What the fuck that says, that's a non-disclosure agreement, motherfucker. You won't come into my world. You won't have to learn to shut the fuck up. Let me find out. I'm about to take it to that level because people talk too fucking much in these streets. And they got the nerve to say divine feminine. I, I see why your ass is still single. No, I'm protecting myself. Motherfucker so much. She, some of y'all nasty. Divine feminine, some of y'all are Y'all nasty as hell. It's some freaks. It's some freaks watching me right now. Y'all nasty as fuck. And so when you get with somebody, it is what it is. And you and it's real. That's not for everybody to know. So this is how they doing you out there, Divine, Divine, Divine Feminine. This is how they doing you out there, Divine Feminine. They doing you like this. I feel for whoever's weakness is. I feel for you because they are judging you for having sex too soon. They're judging you for what the fuck went on in the bedroom. They're judging you for whatever reason. They shouldn't be judging you in a fucking way. But somebody is judging you and 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 I mm -mm. that's that shit that make me want to call somebody. Never prejudge. <laughs> Never prejudge and be the humble that a, okay. Man, you don't want to get involved. Fuck. Mm. 
Mm-mm. Don't even, I don't even want to go there. I do not need to be in prodigy energy right now. That is not, we're going to try to keep this nice and feminine going forward. I want to close, but how do I close? Okay, Divine Feminine, we're going to close with you. Feminine, what is it? What's, how do we close with Divine Feminine? Can I get one? We got the same energies from the beginning. This is, we don't change shit about you. Just keep it moving. Okay, you are definitely protected. We got the Empress of Protection. We have the healing. Okay, so yeah, just continue to heal. And we have the High Priestess. Listen, do you. Continue to do you. Okay, High Priestess, we got protection and healing. Listen to me. Divine Feminine, just continue to heal. Fuck this person, whoever this person is. Next time, follow your intuition because the high priestess is here. The high priestess knows. Next time, follow your intuition. Follow your intuition next time. Okay? Honor your inner knowing. Okay? How he close for masculine is like this. Oh yeah, he yeah, he gonna try to get back. Yeah, he gonna regret that shit. Trying to find his way back to you like Jaheem and shit. Inventor and trying to get yeah, integrate, trying to bring y'all back together. But I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if you're gonna feel like it. I don't know how much damage has been done out there in them streets with all this fucking gossip. Okay, I I don't know how much damage has been done. Or if, or if you even want to, but, but, but however you take this here, read, listen, man, make sure it fit in your world. Mina means once again, time Oracle here. Okay. Hold on. Cause this ring won't come off my finger. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Listen, y'all. I'm out. One. I'm trying to close, but I can't see. So I'm going to have to just turn the phone off. Bye. Give me this goddamn phone. I can't see a motherfucking thing. And I'm trying to close this shit. Power off, nigga. <laughs>